Yes. So to cut back, to spend less, do less, use less mm -hmm. of something. Um, yeah, I drink a lot of coffee. I and mean, you probably should cut back. It's turning my teeth yellow. No. Um, <laughs> I need to cut back on my sugar. I'm going to get diabetes. No, huh? Good. Yeah. Need to cut back. Darling, you need to cut back on spending money. You spend way too much money. Let's cut <laughs> back. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> So, yeah, cut back. yeah, cut back on eating so much, period. Eating too much. I eat too much. I need to cut back. So, yeah, go ahead, Saw. You got this. Yes. Yeah, that is the number six to cut back. Good, Daddy. Your examples. This is when you spend less, you do less, or you use less of something. This is very commonly used by government or companies also. Example, the government has announced plans. Uh, to cut back, to cut back <laughs> on the fence is spending by 10%. Now notice I said on. If you specify this something, the fence is spending, you need to use the preposition on. Cut back on. Cut back on the fence is spending. I could also just say, example, the government announced the plans to cut back. Yes. In that sense, you is just reduce spending, spending less, and then you can you have to clarify, well, cut back on what? Now, we frequently use this as advice to someone. Let's say you told me, uh, Sabrina, I drink 10 sodas a day. I would say, whoa, you should cut back. You should... Uh, consume less that is too much soda you should cut back 